Hey everyone, I'm Rachel Cruz with The Every Dollar Team, and I've got a question for you. Where do you think Americans tend to overspend the most? Well, we did some research to find out, and the answer is food. Now, you can't cut out food from your budget, but you can do something about it and how much you spend. So here are six tips on how to save on groceries. Number one, meal plan. And I mean planning out breakfast, lunch, dinner, and even snacks. This is seriously so important. I even made a meal planner and grocery guide because it's my number one tip on food savings. When you plan what you're gonna eat every single meal, you're way less likely to cave in to those drive-through temptations, and you can make sure that you're not wasting food when you shop. Number two, make a grocery list and stick to it. Use your meal plan to create a grocery list. And then when you're shopping, don't buy things that are not on the list. You know what you need, and it does your budget no favors to go and grab extra stuff. Everything extra just adds up. Number three, raid your pantry. When you're making a meal plan, look in your pantry, your refrigerator and freezer and see what you already have at home. And then you can build meals off of those things. Again, it helps you waste less and spend less. Number four, try curbside pickup. This helps you buy just what's on your list and not get distracted by the big bag of individually wrapped dark chocolates that will be calling your name right when you enter the store. Plus, one of my favorite parts of curbside pickup is that you can see the total amount online or in the app. That means you know what you're gonna pay before you check out. You can just delete stuff out of your cart if you're spending too much. No surprises, and I love that. Number five, buy generic. You can be a little snobby on certain items if it's in the budget, but a lot of the time the generic is made with the exact same ingredients. So read those ingredients, pay for the product, not the fancy name brand logo. Number six, last but not least, budgets. If you don't budget already, you should. And that means having a grocery budget line. Plan for what you're gonna spend here and be realistic based on your family size, dietary needs, where you live, all of those things. It might take you a few months to figure out how much you should spend here, but once you find a good planned amount, keep to it. And hey, if you want help with that last one, check out our free budgeting tool, Every Dollar. It's what I use to budget for groceries and everything else every single month. And remember, if you use these tips, you'll keep from literally eating away at your income every month. Listen, there are so many ways to save money, but if you focus in on this one category, if you plan out your meals and plan out your budgets, you'll make a big impact on your spending. 